Previously on Dad's Academy. When Dad thought I was the best, it was barely acceptable. Now he knows I'm the worst. He was never going to come, was he? He was absolutely going to try. I think I like you. It's not true. I know I like you. You will not ditch me because you're confused. Okay. I have to go. There's someone at the door. Come with me. I can't. Why not? You'll be understudying Clara. You should be very proud of your audition. You argued for Tara in the audition, and I saw enough potential to give her a chance. But she's struggling. Abigail, you take over Tara's part for this rehearsal, please. Good, Abigail. I've always believed in magic. It's no secret that Clara's rehearsals have been a bit hit and miss. I'm hoping that changes now that we're in the theatre. Not wizards and sorcerers. My magic is the kind of four-leaf clovers and star signs. Oh, wait, come on, T. This is you. And that in another life, I could fly. This is not all for me. You, and that's my mirror. <laughs> it used to be so easy to believe in magic. These days, I'm just struggling to believe in myself. Tara, I'm not going to sugarcoat it, but the understudies' run-throughs have been more consistent. I will not be making a decision until after the dress rehearsal, but I want you to both be prepared for the fact that I may be switching the roles. Someone's told my dad that our exam results come out tomorrow. And he wants to discuss my five-year plan, like... I was thinking this could be a, a good chance to get to know other guys and other years. Why? I don't know. I guess you could figure out if you're... Or not. He's fit. Mate. Too soon. Just a little bit. Big theatre, Tara. I need you to tell the story with your whole body. I didn't mean smile more. This is not an Estedford. Better. When are you getting the costume for this? Um, this afternoon. Stay. I don't understand why Act One goes so well, and then you get to this solo. All right, that's it. We'll have to come back to this. Moving ahead to snowflakes. She takes a while to process. When she gets... If you were directing this, would that still be your call? Abigail is the safer option. Technically proficient, a little cold, but... Clara is meant to be weaving her way through the snowflakes, not crashing into them.
car may be a risk, but when she gets it, there'll be magic. I promise. Yep, no, the parents are fine. But then, ever since I got too old for daycare, they haven't known what to do with me over the holidays. Is that Miles? I'll call you back. Looking forward to meeting this young man. Um, hi, Dad. Sorry, are we talking? Sweetheart, we're always talking. Well, me walking out of the audition, you instant coronary. Dad, if there's been a ceasefire, nobody's shown me the white flag. I'm just giving you space to do your own thing. It's what you've always wanted, right? Let me take that. Oh, T, uh, can you pick a dress that you like and take it down to wardrobe for alterations? OK. I took the newest. Dust doesn't work with my allergies. Imagine if your parents drive all this way and you're not even dancing anything. Ouch. I'm just saying. They'd have to make you a party guest. Or a flower. Wow. That is weirdly perfect. I, I don't think it needs to be altered at all. Girls, I have some notes. Tara? Yep. <laughs> Sorry. I haven't seen that costume in a long time. Oh, it's an ancient. My mum wore it. And Olga Baranski and Dame Josie Doran. Yes, it came out with the Ballet Russe. 1936. Superstition says it's never had so much as a broken thread. Take good care of it. It's gorgeous. <sighs> I need you to tell the story with your whole body. You going home at all tonight? I just thought I should try the solo with my costume on, see if it made a difference. It did. So how long were you standing there? Um, did you see anything strange? Strange, yeah. Never mind. I can't believe this year is almost over. Yeah. Hoping Sammy's dad gets off his back, or else holidays at the Liebermans will be a little tense. Well, if he doesn't, you should so come stay at the farm. I'm serious. They always need the extra help, and Christmas lunch we have like 50 people over, so you wouldn't be in the way. How do you have 50 people? Cousins, second cousins. We all go swimming in the dam. I think you'd really love it. Yeah. But then, other stuff would probably happen. Is that, I don't know, is that a bad thing? Tara, you and I don't really have the best track record. I'm sorry, I, I just No, don't you're think right, that... bad idea. Just forget I said anything. Take that. 
bed anatomy and stuff it in your prosthetic fascia. You know we do anatomy in second year as well, yeah? Scholarship? Part shared with mum. I got it. <laughs> and I topped everything. Yes, hip hop, I said everything. Check out audition week. Excuse me. Hi. Can you tell me where the dressing room is? Um, back the way you came and second door to your left. Is it amazing being at the academy? <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. <laughs> high distinction. High distinction. You're in the top percentile of every subject. I know how I place academically, but what about my, uh, my dance exams? These are your dance exams, Sunny. You should be really proud of how far you've come this year. Which is why I was so disappointed to receive this email from your father. Sorry? It says he's withdrawing his financial support. He doesn't even want you here. Why is next year any different? Because I'm in grade 11 next year. The subjects you choose, the school you go to, they all affect your university entrance, Samuel. Mum, yeah, could you put me up to Dad? OK, OK, well, you tell him that my phone is on. If he wants to call me, he can, but he can't make up his mind until he sees me dance tomorrow night. So you and Miles got any exciting plans for the holidays? Um, why are we talking about this now? Because <laughs> I'm trying to distract myself. Break a leg, Tara. If after the rehearsal I decide to recast, I want you to be the one to tell Tara. doubted it for a second. It's, it's this dress. It's like magic. When I'm wearing it, nothing can go wrong. <laughs> Listen, I've decided to stick around Sydney for a bit. Dad's offered me a job as his assistant. There's some stuff I can learn. Sounds smart. You should stay with us over the break. We can take class. You and Kat can hang out. You and I can hang out. Just think about it. Uh, I, don't, I don't have to. I'm in. Really? Will I be able to change any time this century? All right, we'll talk details <laughs> later. I have a favour to ask. Tickets are sold out and some idiot put my parents together. I'm not sure if you heard, but they won't come if they're sitting next to each other. I was just wondering whether one of yours might swap with mine. Oh, um... Forget it. No, no, I can ask them. It's fine. I'll sort something out. Not much, just a couple of presents, but it would be awesome if you could play Santa at the right moment. Why are you not planning on being around? No, actually. Miles and I are flying to Darwin, doing a road trip around the country. Oh, I hadn't heard. It's not exactly for public record yet, but I was planning on calling Ethan from the airport and then he could let everyone know that I'm... You're running away. Going away. Oh, you were actually the one person I thought would understand. Look, there's one in there for you. So I'm stuck in the Bermuda Love Triangle. Do you still like Ethan? I don't know, maybe. Kat, would it totally ruin your holiday if I went out with your brother? Okay, stop! Why? Did you see a shark? No, Sammy. Well, it's the end of the year. You guys are my two best friends. Can we just be here for a minute together? Contemporary. Distinction, pas de deux, 
high distinction. General comment, Christian lives up to his potential. I, um, I just wanted to say, thanks, Mum, for making me audition. So anyway, there's, um, there's this girl. May I help you? Uh, I don't know. I'm doing work experience. I have to take costumes. Okay, those are for side stage changes, and those are fine to go into storage. And that one? Storage. Thanks. With me out front? Uh, no, I'm, I'm going to stay back here with the costumes. Sure, okay. You're seriously leaving now? I finally worked out what we both have in common. This is it for us. These guys are our family. So quit dancing. Blow off your parents, but at least say goodbye. They'll try to stop me. Hey, Miles. Yeah, I'm on my way now. Yep. Bye. Abby? Oh, Abigail, I fixed up the tickets and your mum's sitting with mine. Close. Miss Rain, when you danced Clara, what costume did you wear? I never danced Clara. Dead and no show. Yeah, well, mine hasn't spoken to me since he found out I had a boyfriend, so. Really? Hey. Hey, let's do this. Is that it? Yep, that's it. Sorry, Sebastian? Yes. I was just hanging my Clara costume side stage. Obviously nothing's gonna happen to Tara. Anyway, I noticed her nightgown doesn't seem to be there. I'm sure it's fine, I just thought I'd better mention something. What's happening, Abigail? Thank you, Abigail. Ethan will check that out. Sure. Fun. What? What did you do with it? Hey, back off, okay? It's just been misplaced. All right, wardrobe gave me these. No, Tara's had a blue sash. Uh, yeah, no, everything's under control. Look, Tara, you're just gonna have to wear one of these or I have a gals. I can't. It's just a costume. No, it's not. It'll be like in rehearsal. I never got through this act without the costume. Abigail will have to go on. Oh, I can't have a different Clara halfway through. Right, Tara. What do you need? Cat. I need to talk to Cat. Okay, 
someone find Can someone find my sister? Wait, whoa, whoa, please, slow down. It's gone and I can't dance without it. I'll make a fool of myself. All right, Abigail, stop getting close. Okay, no, listen. You're an expert at making a fool of yourself. Where are you? That doesn't matter, okay? What does is that you stop making excuses. Look, I get that you're scared, T, but you need to suck it up and do what it is that you've been working for this whole year. Cat's right. You're gonna have to go on because I'm not. You're better... You're better at this than me. With or without a costume. And the audience will see it. Do they even know you're going? Listen, I don't care if we miss this plane, if we miss the next one, or we don't go at all. All right, all I care about is you. Why are they holding the curtain? Wardrobe issue, but I think I'm ready now. I know you are. Wait, wait, wait. Can you read that for me, please? You didn't make it in a second year. Okay. So, Christmas Day. Are your family seafood people or turkey? What? You know, I'd love to come down to the farm with you if that's still cool. You have the worst possible time. I think you're about to miss your entry. After get six jobs, I'm staying at the academy. Shh. I'm watching the dancing. So I'm in this place I've only ever glimpsed before where gravity can't touch me, nothing can. If I think about it, I can feel the ache in my knee, but rather than stopping me, it's spurring me on, a reminder. One of the hundreds of turning points over the last 12 months that have brought me here, to this moment. And finally, I'm flying. Hey, welcome to the official Dance Academy channel on YouTube, the only place on YouTube where you can find all the Dance Academy episodes. Have a look around.